in the 14 cases that have been previously mentioned, uh, in each of those cases, uh, regulated companies were also a, a party to your suits, is that correct? In some instances, yes. In most of them. Can you name a few instances in which you have filed a lawsuit in your independent capacity as Attorney General against a corporate entity for violating state or federal pollution laws? Senator, I have a list here that's been provided. Can you name them, please? Sure. Uh, there's a list that uh, uh, that has been... Can you name one? Yes, the, the first is the uh, Mayhart Egg Farm involving uh, a CAFO situation and, and uh, uh, cleanup of a large hay, uh, hen operation uh, that affected water quality. Uh, did you file a lawsuit feeds. in that case, sir? I, I did, Senator. Okay, and what was the outcome of that case? Uh, we received a good outcome against them. And the name of that entity was what? Mayhard Egg Farm. And can you name any other cases where you have actually filed a lawsuit against a corporate entity for violating federal pollution laws? In fact, that case was brought in conjunction with the EPA. And I want to address something, Senator, earlier. When you say independent capacity, those cases that you referred to, the list of cases, were in, as an extension of the DEQ in the state of Oklahoma, an extension of agencies at the federal, at the state level that had authority granted to them by this body that we were... And I understand, I understand that role as a former Attorney General, but right. that is you representing your client. I'm asking about your independent capacity as the Attorney General of your state. Let's move on. On the issue I, I, of I mercury. I would suggest that the Senator's time has expired in terms thank of you. moving on. Uh, thank you. I would like to introduce for the record a, an art, a letter